Hi, welcome to Thoughts on the Porch. Uh, today we're going to talk just for a moment about a book uh, called The Yellow House. It's by Sarah Broom. Now, it's, uh, it's, it's what we call an autoethnography. So it's not really an autobiography because that's uh, a very specific thing. And it's not a memoir, although it has a foundation memoir. But it's an autoethnography, which incidentally uh, is what I'm studying in grad school. And the idea is uh, that she's tracing her life, but it's juxtaposed against particular incidents. In this case, uh, Katrina and the survival of Katrina. Now, before I go any further, this is not some trite, oh, poor, pitiful me, I lost everything Katrina. It's, it's just the opposite. It's a beautiful, poignant, stirring, rich uh, story of a woman who finds herself and finds her family and travels the world and it's so well written uh, the literacy that's that goes into this so we have some uh, standard standard English or standard uh, literacy which is what we typically read or hear on the news we have something that's called black English which um, June Jordan was kind of a uh, an early champion of black English which is not ebonics, they're different things, although there are some similarities. She also uses heightened language, heightened language, of course, being the academic style. So Sarah Broom, who is unquestionably brilliant, okay, let's be clear about that, she's a brilliant writer. She's able to weave these three very different lexicons into a story of, of redemption, of, of search, of identity, uh, you know, when you figure what she's been through, which is, of course, Katrina, uh, and her family has been through, she could very easily just become a whiny, vapid uh, victim. But she's never a victim. She's never a victim. She is, uh, she's a pioneer. She's a, uh, uh, she's someone who helps other people, which, you know, people that have been through something like that and still find the strength to help other people. Um, she's daring, she's brave, she's funny, she's sweet. If you want to be entertained with a book, if you want to find a book that will wrap you up, uh, The Yellow House by Sarah Broom. Uh, I can't recommend it strongly enough. If you know me, you know I love to read, you know I love to write, you know I love to study the language. Uh, go out and buy this book. Just go buy it. Read it. Um, okay. That's it for the Thoughts from the Porch. Yellow Book. I'm sorry. Yellow House. Sarah Broom. Great book. Don't let it get away. Uh, it'll give you something to do while you're quarantined.